The Exercise Man is on the move, bringing health and exercise to you and your family. The Paul Gaudino Family Fitness Show promotes body, mind, and spirit for a healthier family and a stronger America. Paul Gaudino is a winner of the President's Council on Physical Fitness Leadership Award and two-time Guinness World Record holder for the longest-running family fitness show seen in America. The Exercise Man is on the move and coming to the neighborhoods around the world to help you come alive with exercise and live a healthier, happier lifestyle. Yes, life does begin at 40, and the key to better health is daily exercise, good nutrition, and proper rest. This program is dedicated to you, your family, and your well-being. So let's get on the move with Paul Gaudino, the Exercise Man. Thank you, thank you, and hello, everybody. Hope you had a great weekend. Well, here's the beginning of a new week. So remember, if you haven't exercised for a while, always check with your doctor. He or she will tell you what you can do for your lifestyle. And this is so important because a lot of times we think we should do this. Maybe it's bad for you. That's why it's important to check with your doctor. And the best time to do it is on your birthday. So you can't forget. Start out that new year, that new birthday, feeling great and have more confidence in yourself. But exercise should be a part of your life. And if you can't exercise in an actual exercise group, try to build it in everything you do. Walk up the steps, walk up, take the uh, uh, steps instead of the escalator and park your car a little way from the uh, house or from the shopping center. And you'd be surprised what you can do and still feel good. Nice to see so many people ready to go and we're ready to come into your home and help you have a new vibrant life. Okay, let's start out with some warm up exercise. But first of all, deep breathing exercise, boys and girls. Bend down and breathe in. Come on, throw that chest out, bring down, breathe in through the nose, one more time, blow out, blow out candles, breathe in. All right, now what we're going to do, your hands on your hips, we're going to just kick to the side like this, like kick your shoes off and stay a while. Don't kick your shoes off, keep them on. Okay, Mr. Music, are you ready? Let's start our day off with positive thinking, a new way of thinking. Remember, it's all up to you. Only you can change you. Now let's get that knee up like this. One and two and three and four. Now remember, wear tennis shoes or something that's comfortable, comfortable fitting socks and close that stretch. Maybe make you feel good. Wear, get something nice because if you're doing it every day, you want to look good. And if you look good, you feel better, don't you? I don't know about you, but a lot of people tell me that when they dress up, they go up. They feel so much better, more positive thinking about life. One more and rest. Now I want you to cross over like this and then stretch out. Over, out, under, out, over, out. This is all part of a warm up. See, when you warm up, it's just like your car, it runs better. And your body does the same thing. Gets that blood circulation all around your body there, strengthens that heart, and gives you more energy. And that's what we all need, especially today. Okay. One more and rest. Now, if you have a couple of weights handy, if you don't, that's okay. We're gonna do our shoulder shrug. This works the back of the arm. You can use a couple of cans of soup or whatever. Okay, roll your shoulders up and then back. Again, up, use a couple of pound or four or five pound, whatever's comfortable for you. Round, up, round, tense it up. You can see when you let it loose, it's nothing happens. When you tense up, you can feel that in the tricep. And throw that chest up, that's it. Ah, oh, you're looking better already. I'll tell you. Look out life. Big changes are coming. Up, around. Now let's work our hands like this. Cross back and forth, I guess. Rotate those wrists. This is important, especially for senior citizens. That's why a couple, couple, right? well, a couple bottles of water. We all have water around, right? Or if you don't, get a couple empty bottles, somebody throws away, fill them up with sand or water. Use them as your little weight. Okay, now I want you to go back like this and hold. You feel how it's working the back of the arms and straighten up tight. Pull the stomach in, chest out. Here we go, down, stretch. Medicine with music with the accident prevention. That's what we're all about for the last 41 years. Back, then up. How long am I gonna be on TV? Well, I hope as long as God gives me the strength. But I'm shooting for two more years. Again, back, and then up. Again, stretch back, 
and up. Okay, we'll put that aside. Now what we're gonna do with our hands and our hips like this, we're just gonna come down and touch the floor and then come back up again. I'll go from the side, keep your back at flat. Better flat angle there, that's it. Remember, exhale going down, inhale coming up. Exhale, inhale, and then throw your shoulders back. Be proud. We're gonna see big changes in you. Down, back. Remember, when somebody criticizes you, that's fuel for your body. Kind of keep that in mind. Back. One more time. And rest. Now we're going to do a little bit of marching in place. Do this right in the commercial break. Because when you pump those legs, you're pumping that butt up to the heart and bringing that body back to life. All right, we've got a little timeout coming in. A lot of important things to see from my community to your community. So we'll be right back. You know, the idea of our show is getting you out of the house. First of all, exercise at home till you build up that self-confidence in yourself. Then get out and join another exercise group because these people help motivate you. When you feel like down, ah, I had enough for today, they will keep you going, especially when you get compliments, and that's important. Okay, we have a great video here. Life begins at 40 or, uh, well, from head to toe with my wife, Barbara. It's a fantastic workout, and believe me, it works every part of your body. And it's only $19.95, plus $3.95 for shipping. That's half the cost of the shipping. We pay half for you. So again, get that six-pack, which is coming up. Well, it's, it's there whenever you want it. You can buy six of our videos, and you're actually, that's the idea of the show. We want you to feel good, look good, and have more energy. So I want you to lunge forward like this, and we're going to just hold that stretch there just for a little bit. Be kind of just up and down in a little gentle wave to work on the knee and the quadricep muscle. Nice and easy, that's it. Okay, Mr. Music, whenever you're ready, I'm ready. Now the other side. Come on, Gus, keep it going. Stretch it back. Oh, medicine with music with the accent on prevention. Okay. Okay, now this time what we're gonna do, we're gonna stretch out our hamstring hand, uh, muscles. So go on your left heel there, place your hands above the knee and press down. And stretch, stretch. You'd be surprised how you're gonna feel in 13 weeks, unbelievable. Okay, now the other side. On the heel, stretch, stretch, stretch. Come on, Renee. Keep it up, Hazel. Keep going. Come on, Mary Ann. That's it, Anna. Okay, and rest. Now, with your hands folded like that, Let's pray that something happens, but remember, prayer with action works. Go to the left side, over the right side. Work in that spare tower, over, stretch. Isn't it great to exercise with somebody? There's nothing worse than exercising by yourself. I don't like it either. But knowing that you're there and you're exercising, sweating just like I am here, makes me feel good. And especially when you get results, and that's the whole idea of the program, results. Otherwise, we wouldn't have been on 41 years. Somebody's getting feeling better in America. Not only in America, this show's seen around the world. That's right. Thanks to Cornerstone Television, we're seen in many areas outside of the United States. Again, over, back, two more, one more, and relax. Shake them out, that's it. Now down on the floor. Let's keep the momentum going and let's go with our right foot over to the left side. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two. So you've got a lot of plans in the next couple of years or next five or ten years? Well, you've got to have a healthy body and a healthy mind to be able to do those plans. So come on down the floor and join me. The water feels great. Three more, two more, and one more. Now, and that, turn to the side like this. I want you to just hold your hands like this. Just like that. Knees bent, arm forward, up off your up, upper shoulder there, and then drop down. Again, up, hold. Oh, you can feel that in the old tummy. Down, again, up.
somebody paid the price for us. The men and women who uh, protect our country, they're the ones we have to thank. There is no holidays for a veteran. They work 24-7, 365 days. You all have mine saying the calendar, Christmas, Easter, or whatever it may be. But they're still protecting you, and they give it all. So why don't you thank them by buying one of these uh, freedom towels? They're only $10. Display it in your home, office, or else give it to a veteran, even if you don't even know that veteran. But you know that they served our country. You'd be surprised. You'd wrap it up, put tissue paper on a yellow ribbon, and say, thank you for your service. And watch their face. There's nothing a veteran doesn't like any more than a good thank you. Because they believe in America, and they believe in you, and they like the freedom we have in this country, which we, a lot of us take it for granted. So what are the freedom towel today? Be the first one in your neighborhood, only $10, and plus a couple dollars for shipping there. So get on all fours again, slide down the floor. Now, the back is a terrible thing. It's, it takes a lot of abuse. But if it's exercised and it's firmed up, you'll have less uh, back aches and uh, better posture all through life. So let's get on all fours like this and just round your back like this and then let your stomach drop down. Okay, Mr. Music? Round and drop. Oh, I heard a bone cracker. Up and down and stretch and down. Oh, that feels so good. Especially over the weekend, maybe you've been sitting around watching a lot of sports and things like this or or watching a ball game, which is nothing wrong with that, but you got to keep that body in shape, even when you're sitting out in those bleachers. Move your ankles around. Get up now and then. Go to the bathroom. You don't have to go. Comb your hair. Again, up, back. Now, let's try to stretch back as far as you can. Get your head down between both arms and hold that. Now, come forward. Where, bad back, stop wherever it starts hurting. If that's good there, fine. If you can get down like this, it down or arch your back a little bit. Again, back. Oh, nothing like it, huh? Nothing like feeling great. I wish I could exercise for you, but I can't. I gotta do it for myself, too. Why, do I, why don't I quit? Because I feel good when I exercise. I have more confidence in myself. I enjoy the uh, grandchildren and my family. Back. Again, forward. And relax. Now with your right arm out like this, bend your left elbow a little bit. Go down and touch your shoulder. Can you do that? Oh, whoa. Again, up. Stretch overhead. Down. Touch. Work on that waistline. Again, down. Touch your shoulder. One more time. All right. Now let's do the other side, okay? Up. Down. Stretch. And down and stretch, and down, two more, one more, okay, now this time we're going to stretch out the hamstring muscles, so get yourself like this, like the, well, in this position, and I want you to try to touch the heel with your right foot, you can feel the stretch in back of the legs, and now do the left foot, down, alternate now, one, two, three, Four, five, begin or stop. Six, seven, and eight. Very good. I am so proud of you. It's all up to you. Your whole life can change, but you have to change your, your thinking first. Change your thinking, you change your body, you change your attitude, and that's what it's all about. All right, let's do something for the arms and chest. Our normal push ups, but we'll do the knee push ups to start out with again. Push up, hold. Keep the body straight from the uh, shoulders down to the knee. Nice straight line. Here we go. Up. Hold. Down. Come on, Nathan. Keep it going, Mary. That's it, Bob. Two more now. Come on, you can do it. Down. Up. One more time. All right. Very good. Now let's find out what kind of gross motor skills you have. On all fours like this, I want you to raise your right arm out like that. That seems simple enough. Now, can you get your left leg out and hold? Hold it. Hold it. Now, the other side. Stretch. When you're balanced, life becomes balanced. Down. One more. And rest. Now, on your stomach, place your hands under the thighs, and let's do our flutter kick. I mean, 
Yeah, our front kicks the back of the legs there. Tighten up the old back porch. And we'll be right back with more, so don't go away. You know, I truly believe that success breeds success. Every little thing that you come closer to your goal gives you more enthusiasm. I can do it. So set realistic goals. What I mean by that, one to three pounds a week to, to lose, not 10 or 15 or 20. You didn't put it on overnight, so you can't get rid of it overnight. But when you get rid of it, you want to get rid of it slow so you don't have any hanging skin. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. You lost it, just relied on diet alone. But remember, when you rely on diet alone, you become weak, and you lose your posture, and you just start hanging. There's no enthusiasm, so do it slow. All right, let's do some more exercises. Walking in place is a great way to exercise, jogging in place, going out and walk, take the dog for a walk, take the cat for a walk, take the turkey for a walk, whatever. But get those arms and legs and pump those arms and do it every day. Not every day, uh, three to five times a week. I like to always have one day in between if you can. The rest of the winter, do an alternate thing, you know, maybe dancing or uh, bowling or hiking, stuff like that. That's important. Okay, now, one, two, three, four, higher, higher. That's it. Get those knees up. It's pumping the blood to the heart. You can feel yourself feeling better already, getting more color into that body. And that heart is pumping for you to keep you strong. Three more, two more, and one more. And down, take a deep breath, inhale. Blow it out. One more. All right, now these quadricep muscles here, they're very important to help us get up, get down, get in and out of the tub, get in and out of the car. So let's kind of strengthen up our quadricep muscles. Place your hands in your hips like this. Nice and tall, good posture. Get down in this position and hold that. You feel it right in through here, the quadriceps. You practice see it, right? Now straight up again. Suck the stomach in against the spine. And down, hold. Keep it back about a 45 degree angle. I don't want it round. Keep it flat. Up. Down, hold. Ah, you're starting to feel it now, right? That's the idea of it. Up. One more time, down. Down and relax. Now let's do some stretching overhead. Nice and easy. That's it. Touch that toe out to the right side. Move our arm overhead. Again, that time goes so fast. Thanks for letting us spend this time with you. God bless each and every one of you. Stay healthy. See you tomorrow. Never.